Hi everyone, it's Deborah, and I'm doing something today that's a little complicated for me at least. Um, it's a Thanksgiving image that I'm gonna put on one of our pillow blanks and it has 16 pieces. So, and one of them I'm not sure about, it's the big glitter turkey. So we're gonna do this together and if we are success, we'll succeed together and if we're not, we'll learn together. Here we go. First thing we're gonna do is to prepare our pillow blank. And I've got my zipper at the bottom. Okay, I have a lot of elements, so I'm just gonna kind of get a general idea of where they're all going to go. I'm going to just press these enough a few seconds, especially with our mat, because it only requires a couple of seconds just to tamp it down. The only vinyls I'm using today are glitter and matte. So far, so good. Okay, now here's the complicated part. This is the turkey image from Cricut, and it has serrated lines in it. But if I just put it on like this, it doesn't show the feathers. So I am going to remove it from the transfer paper and spread it out a little bit. Wish me luck. <laughs> mm -hmm. Now I'm going to kind of spread him out and hope that some of that shows through. I mirrored this, of course, when I cut it. I think it made a bunch difference. I'm just gonna lay that on top of it. So in retrospect, that may be a difference. You don't need to take that off. And glitter is a cold peel using our HTS cooling block. All right, I'm gonna give it one final press. Making sure everything is covered. I'm gonna give it just a little bit more pressure. I've turned my heat up a little bit 
two for this final press. I've turned it up to 310. And here we go. Thanks everyone. For more tutorials like this, just subscribe to our YouTube channel and remember to hit the bell to be notified of all new tutorials. Thanks again, everyone.